Dante's Inferno. Dante defined our modern conception of hell 700 years ago. But these circles of hell have been rearranged. I'm assuming that perhaps one of the things that, that really piqued your interest about this one was the chance to a bit kind of make a horror movie. There are like horrific elements in this movie that I wasn't expecting to see. Well, thank you. And actually that was something that, that evolved as we began the adaptation, you know? And, and so on the one hand, you get this great book. We all agreed it was terrific. Uh, you sort of a, a nice evolution for the Robert Langdon character, a crisis that's very modern. It's not existing in history. It's about overpopulation. So that's something that we've all thought about. That's a real hot button controversy, but as we began developing it, I started thinking about movie audiences. And of course, I went back and read Dante's Inferno like I was supposed to do in high school. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I realized that he was not only inventing the notion of hell, he was also inventing the modern horror film and that imagery. Because those punishments are like everything that you've seen in every really gruesome horror right. story. And since Robert Langdon is on this mission, he's disoriented, he's not sure how he fits into the whole mystery, and he's following, you know, hell, Dante's hell as a, as a part of this clue path. I thought it was a great cinematic opportunity for me to, to give something else to the audience that actually wasn't so much there in the book, and that's these, you know, these vivid, intense uh, emotions that are sort of swimming around in his mind. You know, this, <laughs> this, this visual uh, uh, manifestation of what hell is, it's very, very specific and it's very, very spooky. And oddly enough, it's something that you could sort of like understand and, and hope doesn't really exist. Uh, and, you know, the, the whole point of this is, you know, you're recreating Dante's Inferno. We created ourselves in the modern world. It's not something just from the dark ages. It's part of the a possible dark future.